friends, hi and welcome. It's the first Tuesday, it's Taco Tuesday. I have $20 for a taco stuffing this week. Also, I am gonna spread some love between two binders. We're going to be using this and I am just going to save a little bit every single month to go towards my debt. So we're gonna taco about debt today and also we're gonna taco about me because this is basically an allowance that I give myself, 20 to $25 every week. I have some news for you though. I did something with the taco money and I bought myself a pair of new running shoes because I am sadistic and I am weird and honestly I desperately want to be a runner without injuries so I did buy a new pair of running shoes and I took the money out of my taco money and let me tell you it felt so good to have that money there to not feel any guilt about splurging on me for a little bit but this is where my quadrants this is where the money is going this year you're going to see this a lot just to kind of center myself and make sure I know what I'm doing so today we're doing a little bit of I guess we're calling this family this is the taco from Liz and then a little bit of debt so that's what we're tackling today but let's get into it we have three L bucks that I'm going to put aside for later Later. and then one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 15, 17, okay, $17 left, $5 that is going to go to debt. I know this is, this is slim, this is slim, but it is a little bit of an extra debt payment and I'm just so ding dang flim flam happy about being able to use this binder. It was a joint collaboration between Champagne with Champagne's Corner and Ren with Mischief Managed Up Budgets and you guys have been loving it too. I know I'm not the only one who has this. I've got this beautiful purple sharp and I think this is just I think this is what we do uh, every other person out there seems to have the one that has dates on it but I went with the one that is undated and the reason why is I wanted to be able to use this year after year you can obviously use the 2024 version it's just that the dates won't line up but I'm happy and they give you this cute envelope and I don't know where these came from. I think they should just sell these envelopes by themselves because I just like the fact that it's see-through and I can see how much is already in there. So $5 out of my taco money is going towards debt. As we get back from my trip to Australia, I'm gonna have more money to be able to allocate into this little world. And we'll see how that goes. But Tuesdays are still going to be taco days. So let's get into the Liz taco binder and I am so excited because I've been able to add some new challenges into it. As you know in the last of 2023 I was just trying to finish off as many taco challenges as I could but this one is from Rami Budget Paparazzi. Save $50. Talk about savings um, and I don't know is this margarita one calling to me? A little spicy one? Thanks Rami. Only $2. I love you a whole 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 lot. So $2 for this one. Stick that card in there and let's see. Oh this one. Okay this one's the meat color. I always forget. I, for, for a second I was thinking that was <laughs> that was meat but no that's the tomato layer. Okay this is from Candy with Stuff and Budget and when I saw this I knew it was instantly going into my taco binder. This was something that she sent in Happy Mail and I was kind of crying as I was was opening the mail and then I went back to like do a fast forward on my video and then it turned out I didn't even hit record. Was I crying? I was I was highly emotional like a lot of the things and the cards that I was re reading like just put me in my feels. I <laughs> tequila and and Liz are not a good combination but I can handle this four dollars. I was just thinking as I was scratching that off I don't even know the last time that I did a tequila shot it certainly may have been in my 20s. So does that make me old? Or does that just make me wise? <laughs> I, I'm really not sure what that means about how I am. Okay, this one, oh my gosh, I have wanted to do this for so long. This is Taco Tree, and of course it belonged in the taco, not with the Christmas binder. This is Lindsay with Boy Mum Loves to Save. I can't say mom with my accent, so Boy Mum. Okay, um, we're just gonna start with the top. 
eight dollars which might mean that we have the first iou of the year and that is a fact so we have six dollars in here but this sweet little corn dog you guys know i love a corn dog corn dog I owe you and that is from Lady Di saves but we will start back on this one next week but look what else I added who sent this to me okay if you sent this to me or did I down okay if you're the owner of this challenge will you please put it in the comments below I real I don't remember did I download it or did someone send it to me either way I loved it and I was thinking you know what Liz needs in her taco money she needs money to buy coffees anyway I love it and I will get to that next week but now let's talk about my weekly money five 580 100 there's a 20 here for a reason and that is for head to toe so let's jump straight to that the reason why it's going to head to toe is because i have a hair appointment right before i get go to australia and it's going to be like not just the color it's going to be the highlights and everything so i probably need about a hundred dollars before we leave for that and i again am i'm just doing the bare minimum with all of these because i want to be able to add extra money to australia so clothes and shoes has 50 60 70 we're just going to give you a sweet little five today I don't think we're gonna need anything for the trip. Dumb things, family fun, gifts, sorry, head to toe, household. Do you, okay, I am on a rampage and I have been unsubscribing from things like crazy, but there is this little washing thing that it, I'm gonna have to put a picture on the screen right now that <laughs> I don't wanna influence you, but if you have one of these things in your house and you love it, let me know. But basically it's to get in like the gunk of the back of the toilet seat, anything that is really hard to reach, the back of the sink, 50, 60, $70 in household. And I was literally thinking, oh, those are all very hard to get to clean places. I need that. But again, this is the year of a low spend. So do I need it or do I want it? And I question my sanity sometimes. And I think I, I just I just want it, but I don't really need it. Okay, $5 extra for medical. Future home, obviously not going to touch you. Invest, not going to touch you. Lizmobile, oh, do I, do I want to put just a little five? Okay, just a little, little something. Some of these categories are actually going to be moved into other binders as I get after I get back from my trip, but it is just what it is for where it is right now. Okay, so let's get through this. We have a thousand dollars that we saved with Madeline's Mountain, one thousand, and the things that are on the credit card are this flight, so mine is one eighty two, one eighty two. Mm, what is? Mine is 182818. I'm losing my mind. So let's give this a zero balance right now. And then let's work on Cam's flight because that is also on the card. So mine is 1304. That leaves us with a balance of $486. But what do we have here? We have 10, 20, 30. 40, 50, so we can apply this to the balance and that leaves us with 436 left in this category, $1,000 plus this money here. Oh my gosh, we're getting down into the last days before the trip and I'm so ready to have all of this paid off. The other thing I did want to note is I did receive a $25 cash gift and I put it in this category here to allow me to do something fun with my kids when we're in Australia. So 225 now, which is a nice amount of money when after you figure out the exchange rate. But that's it for my video for today. Thanks guys and I will see you next time. Bye!